Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mabby. We're back with more Terraria, the Bard class playthrough. Let's go and continue. Let's keep going. All right, so today we are going to go to a new biome today and hopefully get some new items to summon the next boss on my list. It's going to be another Thoria modern boss and it's going to be the jellyfish passion. So we, to, to, to fight the uh, jellyfish, let's check this out here. Jelly fish okay so to craft the jellyfish resonator we're going to need a couple of aquatic bars plus starfish and seashells we got to go to the ocean and grab these now to get aquatic bars the way to craft it is of course corals plus sea scales and sea scales can only be got at the ocean so we're gonna head right over there i've got you wood in my inventory here because i remembered this is the one item that i wanted to craft and i you know that's why i needed the arcane f uh, this thingy <laughs> the arcane armor fabricator this is the only thing that i wanted it for so i'll go ahead and make this new item today this is the you wood loot this is gonna be awesome here so this is a damage plus one let's check this out here now i can make multiples of them because this is the only thing i'm gonna make here uh you would boom i think we're gonna keep going until we get a really bit like a really good one let's see what this does though whoa that is fast that is very fast i like that a lot now this thing is damage up while the bugle horn is life up but this is really cool wow it, it it's pretty strong i wonder if it pierces i guess we'll find out later uh but let's go ahead and keep crafting ones i guess i'll go ahead and sell this one but i, I want one that's better than a rare one so let's keep going uh this is magical seven percent near water uh eight attack speed during the day 14 knockback while moving. I don't think there's any like really amazing good ones. Uh, negative two mana cost. Now it doesn't matter because we can, we we can just re-roll these. I just want the um the uh the bleh, bleh, bleh. I want the uh, rarity to be good. I mean as good as it can be. 24% knockback while moving. Uh, negative one mana cost. Really? Is that really some crazy ones here? Oh, it's fine. I don't think uh, I don't think we're getting anything else out of this. All right. So it's good as is, um, the one that we're using right now, which is the superior one. These ones actually sell for one gold each. Well, they sell for a gold each. That's actually not bad. You know what? I'm going to make a couple more. Actually, how much does just the wood sell for? It was a 28 silver. What? Dude, look at that. All you have to do is make a bunch of uh, loots and I make a bunch of money. No, I, I don't know if, um, you know, making anything else out of this wood is going to give me money. Well, this is really good. I think I'm just gonna craft a couple of the yeah, my god, dude. You know, unless we get a uh, legendary or primal, I'm not gonna bother looking at it. This is a pretty good way to make money in Thorium. Oh! 43% chance, 9% uh, damage when below half mana. Nah, it's okay. Get a better one, maybe. Alright, that's cool. Let's go sell these ones. <laughs> wow, okay. Oh man, look at that. We made a bunch of gold, man. Wow, that's not bad. Not bad. All right, so we're going to be using this for a bit. So let's go ahead and put it on the right one here. So we have our tambourine, and we got this one. This is pretty, very, very freaking sweet. Um, let's look at our expedition quest for today. You still haven't have a bed yet. Wow, it's 28 quests? Oh, my God. What the heck? Graveling hook done. We still don't have a geyser yet. Ugh. Uh, 200 max life. Wizard hat robe. Mushroom biome done. Very done. Uh... King Crown, dead. Cthulhu, dead. 10 gold, honest, done. Um, ooh, an iron crate. Ooh, forgot to give her one, huh? Blue flame die. To get a blue flame die. Blue flame die. Sky cyan and blue. Oh my god, that's. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. I want to combine three of them. You win. Uh, corruption or shadow orb. Alright, the worm. Goblin army. Craft a meteorite bar. Wow, we haven't even seen a meteorite yet. Huh. We definitely want to go explore then, huh? Dude, there's so many quests here. This is insane. Uh, hopefully, we finish one another one of these. Probably not. All right, then conscious man. There you go. Wow. We got a uh, free freaking heart lantern out of that, which is cool, I guess. Free heart lantern, everybody. I'm going to throw away the slime chest and get the golden chest. It's okay. Eternia quest. Much Eternia, much quest. God, this is awesome. Alright. Let's go right to the right side of the world. And, um, 
Yeah, that's good. I'm going to put these away, my Demonite Bar Shadow Scale. Now, what I kind of want to do with these later is I want to craft the Thorium Packs. So, we're going to have to collect a lot more bags of potentials for that. I'm going to bring a Gills Potion with me. And I think that's it. That's everything I needed to bring with me. Let's go to the right side of the world. And hopefully we find any sort of meteors around there. So, I'm ready to go, man. I got my Spectre Boots, Elias Flight. You know, I'm good. I got rid of the Double Jump because we don't need it. Um, yeah, everything seems great. We got our Mrs. Claus stuff on. We look freaking legit. I can't wait to use this on web on a freaking on freaking enemies. This is so cool. I love the effect. It's like a, a like a nice little like boomerang type of thing. All right, let's see if it pierces, shall we? It's a piercing one. Oh my god, that is amazing. Now it's around the same damage, and they both do damage one. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. I mean, this is cool because it barely uses any symphonic damage. Okay, so, you know, I don't know. They're both really cool. God dang, man. Really great. I think um, the tambourine just has a lot more knockback, though. Very strong knockback. Well, this one has average. Very, very average knockback. All right. Come on, what's up? What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Look at that thing. Dang, dude. Both combinations great. We got the damage buff, too. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. See? We finally found the amazing, the amazing bard item that we wanted. All right, to the right side of the world. Let's go explore the underwater and, of course, get a lot of, lots of stuff. One thing that I need to do in the jungle is I need to get my jungle tokens. There's a, I need 25 Inkushi jungle token mods, uh, jungle tokens from the mod. So we can go ahead and craft ourselves the anklet of wind so we can upgrade our freaking Spectre Boots to the other one. So everything we have here is pretty good. It's gonna be nighttime soon, but that's okay. Doesn't really matter. Um, because we do, can we, because we can only fight the Jellyfish Queen in the morning anyway. So this is good. Okay, come on, bruh. All right, let's go. Nice, there's a jungle token. I wonder how many we have. I don't think I've really farmed in the jungle, nor have I went down at all in the jungle. Not really, no. Here's all the enemies. I wonder how, like, much it, like, pierces. It would be really, really nice if we can use this against the freaking Eater of Worlds. So if we ever need any more, you know, Demonite or... Which we probably will, you know? Like, the, the Shadow Scale, you gotta kill the worm, but, but Demonite, you can just get from the Aiko Tutu, which is way, way easier. So we'll see what happens, man. We'll see what happens. Do... I love this little doggy following me. All right, let's go. I actually should have brought one of the uh, worms so I can fight it here and just freaking destroy it, man. Freaking ready. Freaking get my revenge from last episode. I didn't have a piercing item, but I do now. But I do now. All right, it's time to fight in the ocean. We don't have any way to increase our, uh, our uh, what's it called? Our rate of spawn right now. So we haven't not been this far yet. And we might find a meteorite, which is good, because in our inventory, we actually have a lot of sticky bombs, which is probably one of the best ways, I think, to, to mine a meteorite. We save a lot of freaking time and effort, and uh, who knows? There's most likely going to be, and I really hope there's a good one, a barn weapon or armor set for us to use. I would really, really like it. I want to freaking destroy these guys. God damn, this entire stupid people like nothing. It's so good, this loot. I love it. Pew, pew, pew. And it's a superior one, right? Yeah, superior one. I'm getting hurt by everything here. I'm trying to light up the area too, just in case we have to run across here multiple times, which we might probably will. And we at the ocean. All right. It's a corrupted ocean. Would you believe it or not, it's a corrupted ocean. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, build a nice little way out here. Ah, ah, no, you don't. No, you don't. Nice try, buddy. Nice try. Oh, that sucks. Nice little corrupted ocean. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's uh, it's not good. It's not good. Okay, let's go. That's, that's high enough. That's high enough. Actually, it might be a little too high. We also uh, want to. Hey, I think that's the. Uh, yep, there's the angler. Oh, you know what? I don't have any more room. I don't have any more houses. He's here. He's gonna die. Uh, yeah, but I, I don't have any more NPC houses. I need to make a little bit more. But it's easy because I'm going with the really, really, really basic design. Extremely basic design for NPC houses this season. So, yep, no problem for making it. Not like the. Uh, have you guys been checking out the uh, season nine? Um, season 9, uh, freaking yo-yo class. The freaking house that I'm making is insane, dude. It is absolutely insane. Alright, so how, like, how am I supposed to fight ocean enemies if the stupid biome thing is messed up? 
I'm gonna have to go down here and do it. Yeah, because I need there. There's some C scales there. Here's a zombie, but I don't think it's gonna give me a C scale. No, he the angler is left. Oh, let me guess, did he die? Oh my god, feels bad. I need to make a bunch of gills potions. I really, really do, but it's required me to grab a lot of stuff. Yeah, this is really not the best place to farm in the ocean right now. It is not good, but I'm gonna make the bridge to the end of the edge of the map here, and we'll go from there. Hello, Raven. That's so Raven, it's the future I can see. Freaking Raven, dude. All right, let's see. Gotta light it up too. I might, you know, make this the arena to fight the good old jellyfish queen. It's pretty good. I usually always fight her on the left side of the world for some reason. I wish I had a way of purifying this. Actually, I do, but it's not that good of a purification thing. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. Ocean token. Take me by the token mission, ocean token. All right, so I'm gonna use the skills potion. It's the only one I had left over. It's gonna be two minutes, so let's go down here. We got two minutes to grab everything, which uh, you know we do have a lot of. Uh, uh, we do have a lot to cover, but we should be fine. All right, give me the. Oh, we got all the tokens. All the tokens. Huh? What's that? Master bait. I think that that dropped from from the from the kid, right? All right. I don't know if you guys can see that, but uh, there's a little bit of a biome here in the bottom left. All right, let's go. We got two minutes. Let's do this. Grab a bunch of sand, I guess, and do all the stuff here. Dang, dude, look at that. Choking aura. This is the thorium biome, guys. You gotta be really careful about this biome. This is good. I need to fight all these guys as much as possible. Come on. I need all the sea skills. I got two minutes to get as much sea skills as I can. This is great. We got the piercing item, really, really perfect for taking enemies out quick and easy and fast, really fast. All right, let's grab all of the starfishes. Oh my god, that thing is fast, the Barracuda. Ooh, good thing we're good at bursting enemies, though. I can barely see a dang thing. Depth scales, depth scales. Oh man, can't wait to do that as well. But I'm here to grab a lot of the, a lot of the stuff on top, starfishes and corals and stuff. Because I don't remember which one. It, it's one of these things like coral or seaweed that I can make more gills potions so we can mess with it. Do And make some more gills potion because this is... I am really no way of surviving down here, not really. I mean, I, I could open this up and maybe get like the water breathing thing, but that's that's kind of garbage. Like this water breathing reed? No one wants that. Really? Who's, who wants to... No one uses the water breathing reed. Alright, there's another one here. Alright. Hey, I got some uh, black ink. Really nice. Yeah, uh, only a couple more seconds left. Better hurry, man. A lot of enemies, though. Oh, man. The shark. Oh, shark, dude. Ooh. All right. Come on, buddy. Tamber is really good. I can only throw the... I can throw the one out. Uh, hold on. Okay, just gotta grab everything. Forceful tridents. And we're about to drown. All right, let's just get to the other edge here. Get to the edge of the edge here. That's right. How many corals do I have? Maybe do I want to farm a couple more? No. Oh, let me, let me get the breathing read on me really quick. All right, I'm going to go all the way to the left side. Hold on. I have 14 sea skills. Yeah, I think I want a little bit more. I'm going to run all the way to the left side, and we're going to fight it in the ocean just a little bit more. I think I might be able to dual wield this while using, um, you know, a, a, a freaking bard weapon. That would, I, that's actually pretty cool if I can do that. Let's put it on the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can dual wield it. Oh, that's great. All right. Uh, let's get rid of this trident. We don't need the trident, water chest, or whatever. Shurikens, no thank you. We have a mining potion. See, depth scales. That's really important. Alright. So let's go down here a bit and uh, let's just try to get some. I really can't go down there yet because I have no way of surviving. At least not yet. More sea scales. More sea scales, please. Pew, pew, pew. Damage 4% up. Really good. So what's the damage 2 buff? Is it going to be 8%? That would be insane if it is. Excuse me? Starfish? God, such a good item. I love this loot, dude. Yeah, I guess it was nice that we got the, um, you know, the, the freaking buff. The thingy down here. Alright. Let's destroy the shark! Man, it can actually shoot, like, a, at a pretty good, uh, at a pretty good rate, even when my thing is depleted. Oh, it doesn't go that far, though. I'm running out of health, I know that. I'm going back up. Go up, go up, go up, go up. Oh, close. All right, a little bit more. We can get to do a little bit more. Freaking, freaking corrupted depths, man. 
freaking stopping me from doing cool stuff. I got, oh my god, dude. Hammerhead from Thorium. That's a specific Thorium enemy right there. That's cool, man. Yeah. I got some depths, dude. The corrupted depths. I can't believe it, man. I really want to go down there. I can't yet. Ooh, Barracudas. At least we're seeing some of the new enemies from Thorium that you can, that you can fight down here. Some of them. But I do need more sea skills. I think uh, eh, it's a good amount. It's a good amount. What does this turn into? Oh my god, I'm running out of health. I don't know. Oh, health. Ugh. All right, I keep running to the left. Um, 29 corals. Um, where's my se only six seashells? Oh man, I need more than that. I, I probably need more than that, dude. How do you make the uh, gills potion again, though? Because I would be really useful, huh? All right, one more time down here. One more time. One more time. Let's go. Let's go. Freaking sharks. Sharks attack. Shark, shark, shark attack. This shark eats like a maniac. Does anyone know where that's from? If anyone knows where that's from, oh my god, dude, I'm gonna easily heart that comment and pin it. Cause holy crap. Please tell me someone knows where that's from. If you do, oh, amazing. Alright. I'm gonna do the question of the day while I'm here, too. I'm not gonna do them at the end of the episodes anymore, because a lot of people like to skip and just be like, yeah, I checked it out. Alright, so let's do the question. Of the day here. Thorium's a really cool mod, right? That adds lots and lots of cool new things. What is an awesome sea creature slash enemy that you would see Thorium adding in the future? For me, I would like them to have some sort of big starfish boss. You know, that would be really, really awesome. We have the jellyfish boss, and they have the other boss that is in the depths, but I would like to see another maybe beach boss or something out here. And, uh, yeah, I would like it for it to be some kind of starfish, because starfishes don't get enough, uh, they don't get enough recognition for what they do, which is make Patrick from Spongebob famous. So, there you go. Alright. Is there something here? Oh, it's a glow thing. Alright, we're about to head home right now. Let me just uh, get to the very end here. Look at that thing, octopus! I think I got- Oh, it's a giga! Giga mon- monka giga? Monka giga clam? Pearl! I got a pearl! I got a portal, boys. Wonder what that's gonna give us. All right, let's grab the the last set of little items here. I'll TP back home before we die. Hopefully, T. Okay, I'm just gonna go back. Woohoo! All right, we got a lot of stuff, dude. Woo! Pur purple mucosis. I got a pearl. Let's put everything away here. Open up my presents. I don't know why. I got a freaking snow hat. All right, quick stack. Got daybloom seeds, etc. All that good stuff. Uh, let's see. I guess I'll hold it out to the breathing reed for now. Um, and you know what? I'll even put it in here just in case we need to use it. But we'll see. So this is the pre-hard mode fishing tokens. First time getting these. And uh, look at that. You can make the golden fishing while getting 40 of them. Wow, 40 of them? And only using Tinker's Workshop? Screw doing the fishing quest from the angler. You can just do this. Wow, that's actually really cool. Yeah, this is great. Oh, baby, oh, baby. That's that's pretty awesome right there. Uh, let's put the uh, Master Bait in there. The Sea Stars turn into the Slinger's Essence. Goodbye. The mucuses. It's all purple dye. I'm assuming same with this thing. Music Note increases the duration of my, imp in my empowerments by one second. Uh, it's not that important. I don't think it's that important. I don't think I'll make those at all. Uh, we got a Pearl here. Pearl Ring, Radiant Damage up. Music Box. Okay, there's a yo-yo here. Radiant stuff here, healing stuff. There's a chandelier and a lamp. So a lot of this stuff, actually pretty much everything here, except maybe this, is pretty much only for the radiant class, healing class. So none of this here is a yo-yo stuff. So we're gonna get rid of this thing. It's okay here. I could use it to make the ring, but I'll probably get rid of the ring later. Um, so yeah, pearl's cool, it's gone. Uh, okay, shark fins. What do we got? Shark fins. Uh, water walking, hunter, and mega shark. We don't really care for any of that. Alright, open up this goodie bag. Ooh, the princess! The princess stuff. You know what? It's still uh, almost almost Christmas. I'm gonna keep on my, my Mrs. Claus thing, yeah? Alright, the seashell. Only thing to use it is for this. That's great. Okay. That's awesome. Uh, coral. What's that? Oh, it's a subwoofer! Look at that! Your symphonic damage and power is all nearby and uh, allies with coral edge. Damage against gouge enemies doubles the range of your effectiveness. Subwoofers for 
helping out your people, which is fun, but no, thank you. The Gills Potion, here we go. Yeah, I can easily make a bunch of these, right? Gills Potion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we're gonna use this. And we're gonna use that to go to the underground later, because I wanna go explore. I wanna see what's down there. It's gonna be awesome. So that's gonna be a future episode for sure. Starfish, it's gonna help with the, uh... Ooh, look at that, Starfish. Bond. Oh, the Jellyfish Resonator. I have 11 of these, 9 of them. This is the big thing, though, to make the bars. So, uh, one coral, and a sea scale for the aquatic bars. So how much do we need? Four each plus that. We only make a couple, really, if we have to go farm more. But here's the big thing. The depth scale, some thorium. We, I really hope that we find something we can use here. Uh, unhimited water movement. Really, really useful, really useful for a boss coming up. Magic, range. Uh, range, range, range. Ah, oh, there's nothing for the bard. Come on, dude. Really? That's disappointing. Oh, well. I would have loved to see something like that, but it's, it's totally fine. Let me just grab these really quick. They're all ready to go. They're all ready to go. I think I need to, um, I need to preemptively do some water leaf stuff here, man. Let's put these in here. Oh, I don't have any water leaf seeds. Well, that kind of sucks. Uh, that's totally fine. All right, so we're gonna, yeah, you know, okay, so we're gonna craft that thing later. But let's go ahead and make some NPC houses really quick. Actually, they're already made the outline. I just need to put in the tables and stuff, which I was guess I was a little too lazy to do. One, two, one, two, and that, that's that's it. That's all I needed. No joke, no freaking joke here. So one of these is gonna house the angler, and then we have another NPC coming in soon. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, I'm glad we went to go check that out today. Expect us to uh, have everything ready to fight ourselves the freaking jellyfish queen tomorrow. So I'm going to end this one here. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. It helps a lot. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe and upload a lot of daily videos. If you're looking for the question of the day, hey, you skipped to the end of the video. It's, I said it somewhere in the middle. Go check that out. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.